coming back in here for check on day number two on the beaver problems. I know I've got a good beaver out there on the dam break sitting at 3.30. It's me and Judith in here checking traps this morning. But we're going to go over here, take a look at him, and get him out and get the set remade. That is a tank. <laughs> Tried to come through my dam break set right there. And that's a true 10 by 10 cone bear right there. He's filled, the, he's filled that cone bear up. But I'll get him out of the trap and we'll take a better look at him. But that's a tank in the down brake set. <laughs> he got bigger the more I tried to pull him up off. He was just right there. This one right here. It's well, you know, it's well over, I'd say it's it's over 58, probably close to 60 pounds, but it's, whew, it's about as big around as it is long. You laughing, ha ha. Uh, no, I'm <laughs> I'll get it loaded up, that's a tank. Well, the beaver have decided to cover up my trap again. And where the landowner knocked that hole out yesterday, it is plugged up. Fresh chew sticks floated in here next to the dam. <sighs> it's not much of a pond, but the beaver got these lily pads as a food source. And uh, this is just where they're at. I do have a miss on a trap. We'll get in here and kick this out again, make the water flow, give them something to fix, and let's try this again. We'll take a look at it when I get it reset. Whew, stuff's way over knee deep in the mud. I do have the trap beaded back at the dam break again. And I got a little dam break Whew, running right through there. But the way they fixed it the last couple days, they'll come fix this too. So it's not much of a down break, just enough to get their attention. I'll get over and check the other two. I moved over on top of the lodge. I was walking across the lodge and uh, <laughs> I fell in right there, punched through. I'm like, oh no, they're going to bite me. <laughs> so I poked around, poked around. And found the entrance and exit right there. And uh, moved to 330 there. So we'll see if it produces. Should. Once I get out of these fire ants. But uh, I'm going to head out. Nothing over here today. He's getting a weight on that big, big female from this morning. Whew! He's got her drug around here and hung up to get her skin tonight. Her, well, I say that. Her tail's still touching the ground. I thought I had her off the ground completely. But, uh, 63.9 pounds. Yeah. Her tail's still touching the ground. She's right around 64 pounds. Probably. 64 and a half, 64. Well, 63. 63.9. I don't know, a couple ounces probably for the tail touching the ground, but she's a good one to get out of there. Landowner was very happy with that. John just need to catch the problem one over at the other pond. That's burying everything. <laughs> but 63, 63.9 pounds. <sighs>